Hey folks, this is Dan Bell from Intigent, and today I'm going to go over the percent and teams from PowerPoint functionality. Uh, this is really great for co-located team members. Uh, for instance, if you're in a Microsoft team meeting and you want to present from PowerPoint, you can actually, uh, instead of utilizing the share menu within the Microsoft Teams meeting, you can just click a button in the top right of PowerPoint and it'll immediately start sharing the PowerPoint presentation right there. A couple things, so actually three things you need in place. You need the latest version of the Microsoft Teams desktop app installed. You need to have the presentation that you're going to share saved to OneDrive for business or a SharePoint site. And lastly, you need to be in a Teams meeting before clicking the present in Teams button in PowerPoint. Let's get started. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and join this meeting and here we are we're joined and now you can see the the tool is just waiting for other people to join here what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna launch PowerPoint right so let's go ahead and launch this up and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna create a, a presentation from one of these templates here go ahead and create and the first thing I'm gonna do and, and well before I do that let me point out you don't see the button here typically the button would be in the top right presented teams we don't see it. Let's go ahead and save this. Remember what I said, we have to save this to our OneDrive. So I click on my OneDrive here and you can see it says OneDrive there. I can put up my documents folder and sample, right, for MS Teams presenter. All right, click save. And now it's saved and lo and behold, there's the present in Teams button in the top right. And at this point, we can just go ahead and click that button. I will get a notification that says you're about to present this. And so it just gives you that warning to let you know that if there are others in this meeting, they're now going to see the content of your presentation. Click the present button. You can see PowerPoint Live is starting up, preparing my slides, and here they go. And they're now being presented in, and you can see up here in presenter mode. All right, so it's showing content only. Um, so a few things to point out here. Let's toggle through, just click the arrows here notice you have the ability to use your laser point right so if as I'm talking I want people to focus on specific bullet items I can utilize that if I want to circle things in particular colors or if I want to highlight things as well right I have all these interesting tools here available to me okay uh, of course you have the participant list available to you right you can show conversations if there are any um, if you have multiple people here right so you do have this functionality as well um, somebody raises their hand you know they have a question maybe it highlights down here your card and it also puts the hand there as well right and, you know of course you have your emojis your applause your hearts and your thumbs up all sorts of interesting things here you have breakout rooms as well if you want to um, if you're teaching a class and you want people to break out into different rooms to be able to work on a certain activity you can certainly do that as well a number of things you Microsoft Teams has come a long way since it was first introduced and it's really quite a robust collaboration platform wonderful tool set however um, regarding the present and teams functionality if that is how you utilize it it's really a great piece of functionality when you're done you click stop presenting click stop presenting again at the dialogue and that's it folks hope you enjoyed this learned a little something from it if you have any suggestions for other videos have any questions about this video feel free to reach out again this is dan bell from intigent and love to hear from you have a wonderful day